Hello everyone, welcome back to Coffee Grind. My name is Eden. Welcome back to Untitled Goose Game. Your 20 minute dose of chill morning play every morning. Uh, I don't know, what, uh, there's no more to qualify that with. Today we're playing Untitled Goose Game and we were about to venture into the pub. Now the pub is one of my favourite sections of this game. Just because like even the way you have to get into it. Ooh, there's another shortcut here. Uh, just because even the way you get into the pub is different and new and exciting. Like, you have to hide in a box. Now, I just uh, threw my last box over the garden wall, so I hope there's a new box. <gasps> get a new box. Now, I could... Uh, sneak my way in. Or I could try and brute force my way in. Oh, I assumed I could distract him with his, with his tying of his laces. Ah, dang. He's a, he's a crafty one. I need that box back. I need to go back and get the box from the last episode. Uh, bear with me, just a moment. I need to trap one of them in the car, don't I? I assume I need to trap one of them in the car. But anyway, I need to get my box back from the last episode. Because what I did is I expertly got thrown over the wall. Should not have done that until after I'd used the box to go to the pub, really. But here we are. So back into the gardens we go. Back into the gardens to get the box. How are we doing on this fine day? However, uh, by the way, it's uh, these episodes start to come out Wednesday. It's now day four, so it should be Saturday. How are you? How was your week? How was your week, guys? Like you've got to the end of the week. It's uh, I know it's been it's, it's a, I know it's a weird time, but how is your week? Was it, did, you, did you have a good week? Um, what, what are your plans for the weekend? I, uh, I've i been kind of just trialling this and at the same time uh, I'm, I'm sort of between scripts at the minute. I don't have a whole lot on script wise. Um, so most of the work I'm doing is... There's my box. So most of the work I'm doing is editing for other people, um, which is fun. Like uh, I, enjoy, I enjoy doing that as much as anything. Um, course the box script over again but like the the scripts like as far as scripts go i'm not sort of like for the main channel i'm not really making anything uh, big at the moment um i have an idea for a script that's about uh I don't, well i need to do the narratology script which is going to be the next segment of uh the media theory series media f for series um but apart from that i don't really have a whole lot on um, I also want to do a similar video about narrative, but specifically the way uh, the way stories are told in pro wrestling. Um, oh, perfect. Just because the way the way stories are told in, in, in pro wrestling is so radically different. But the problem is, um, Super Eye Patch Wolf did a video that was not dissimilar to that not long ago, and. He basically said everything I wanted to say, but in a better, uh, in a better way and with a better accent. <laughs> so um, I don't really don't quite know what to do with that, with that video. But then I was watching an old uh, Philosophy Tube um, live stream, and he talked about the the life that a script takes on, and he said like the the idea that you have beginning and the idea at the end of the script why it may be two completely different things so i think i'm going to write the script and see if it takes a different form because i adore pro wrestling i adore the way stories are told me and i, and I adore telling stories in general so i think i'm going to write that script because i have a lot to i have a lot to say like 
Specifically, there's a lot to be said about um, a wrestler called Kenny Omega. And if you know who Kenny Omega is, this it's not at all shocking um, that I would want to bring him up specifically. Um, if you don't know who he is, then this means nothing to you. But um, then you just have to wait for the video to come out, I guess. Or you can look at Super Eye Factual's um, videos on pro wrestling. Which, if you haven't watched those, they're so good. Even if you don't like pro wrestling, you should uh, you should give those a watch because they're real good. Right. Um, now I know Make a Friend is a. I know Make a Friend is a uh, goal here, so let's make a friend. Yeah, making friends. And wings! Flippy flappy. Thank you. Be, oh, be awarded a flower, not make a friend. Um, so I've been awarded a flower, but I don't want to throw this flower... I don't want to go put this flower in the... Uh, in the basket just yet because I know that there is a uh, shortcut out the back of here to that same place so I'm gonna put the, sh put the flower back here um, and then because I know that shortcut opens up later so I'll come back to it later uh, is it is this the is this oh this is served dinner isn't it so I need to put the plate down and you also need a glass uh, and salt and pepper yeah am I right in thinking that or is it just uh, knife fork plate pepper candle there we go ha what are you gonna do what are you do you chronically short attention span barmaid like, oh, gee. You broke, you, broke a, you broke a glass. You're going to have to pay for that. Now, meanwhile, I'm going to take this glass, not break it, because I'm a good-natured goose, and take it to its destination, which is here with this fancy dinner that I'm planning. Oh, bloody hell. Does a broken glass still count as a glass? Oh, I didn't even need a glass. Steal a, oh, steal a pint glass and drop it in the canal, of course. I don't need to, I don't need to do anything except that. Why, why am I, why am I, uh, why am I trying to put it in the dinner table? Right. Do I need a knife and a fork? So that is my fork. There's no quick way out of here. I want the boat. Give me the boat. I need to put the boat in the canal as well. I need to wham on that honk key until the uh until the boat comes out. Come on, boat. Come on, boat. You're so close. So close, boat. Boat, 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 boat. Shoe. <laughs> I love the little, the little shoe thing that they do. Right, I think I, I should have distracted them for long enough now. Oh, I can just take it. Wicked. I got the toy boat. 
don't know what to do with the toy boat. Maybe put that in the canal too. Ugh, beans. <laughs> so I'll go put the toy boat in the canal as well. And I'll put, I'll put that with the rest of the things to go in the canal. The flower. I'm talking about just the flower. Where was that cutlery I moved? Darn. I thought, I thought, I keep thinking I can like sneak under the, this table on the way out. Oh, wicked. Now I've got the, uh, now I've got her to drop the fork on the stairs. I can just grab that really easily. Ha, what are you going to do now? You're going to give up. You're going to, you're going to consider that pepper. Lost to the world. That is the world's pepper now. Hey, nope. No, I don't want you to get out the way so I can pick up my fork. Thank you. <laughs> Does that still count? Yep. I'll go up and round then if I have to. If you insist. If you insist, Goose. Well, I think because the, the plate is still touching the... Uh, the handle. Not the handle, the cloth. I think it's fine. Is there like a pour a pint option? Because like having pulled the, the, the cork out of the thing of beer, maybe I need to like put a glass under there. Is that a thing I need to do? I don't remember that. Is that perhaps a thing I need to do? It feels like it might be a thing I need to do. I mean, it would be really cool. I'm going to try it. Come on, this way, this way. Uh, go round, 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 round. Grab the knife. I need to grab the knife. Not the plate. I mean, the plate's cool too, but I need the... I think one of the other things I need to do is... Oh, she should have broken it twice. I guess I'm not pouring my pint. Uh, I think one of the other things I need to do is drop something on the man's head. Um, break the dartboard, make the old man fall on his bum, seal a pint glass and drop it in the canal and set the table. I think I do have a spare pint. I have a, I have a pint glass over here. Um, Uh, this is this is a goal that's that, that that slowed me down for a long time. Like I didn't know like what the timing was on pulling the chair out from under him because he seems to like notice. Uh, 
Breaking the dartboard is another one I'm not certain how to do. So I'm going to focus on setting the table for now. So I need that knife still. No, peace was never an option. Peace was never an option. Don't worry, don't worry, I'm going. You're not having your knife though. No, I said you're not having your knife. This way, go on, go on. Yeah, good old goose. Good old rebellious goose. I love that like in the in the wake of this game, the goose almost came became like a symbol for anarchy. And that's very cool. By my estimations, that's very cool. Um, and I know I'm biased. Because I love the goose and I also love the anarchy. But but still, I really I think it's really cool that the goose became a uh, a stand-in, like a symbol for the, the modern anarchy movement. This, the candle is the hard one. I don't know why he went for the candle. He never goes for the candle. Just an average, average old goose. Not a horrible goose. I'm, I'm a good goose. Yes, the break has been made. The break for it is on. And the table is set. So now I think I either need to make the man fall on his bum bum, which I do not know the timing of. I don't know the timing of the of the make the man fall over. Sorry, that's the dog. <laughs> um, so I, I really I really don't know the timing of the of the sit because it's like it's really specific. I think. Either it's really specific or I'm just bad at it and I'm not sure which is which. Um, do I have a pint glass? I do have a pint glass in my... No, I have the toy boat and the... Uh, I have the toy boat and I have the flower. But I need a pint glass. And I need her not to smash my pint glass. If she could not do that, that'd be great. And that's going to go over in my collection of things to put in the canal. Gently. Although, the canal's the other way, isn't it? Oh, beans. Oh, oh, he's about to break the dartboard. Well, I'm about to make him break the dartboard. Old man playing bar games. So if I... Ah, darn. Too early slash too late. I don't know actually, I don't actually know what I'm trying to do here. There we go. He threw it too heavy or something. I'm not entirely sure what he did. Um, oh, his back's hurting. He's going to grab his harmonica and sit in his chair. And I'm going to have one last crack. 
one last crack at making him fall on his bonbon, bomb, and then we'll wrap up this episode. Ooh, we did it! What an ending for the ep. What an ep ending. So we're going to drop a bucket on the burly man's head. Um, we're going to drop a bucket on the burly man's head next time to uh, to round off. Actually, we're going to have one crack. We're gonna have exactly one crack at, uh, at the. Actually, no. We'll we'll wrap up here, and then next time, tomorrow morning, we'll grab the bucket and drop it on that burly man's head. And until then, have a fantastic rest of your day. I know I will, and we'll see you tomorrow morning for some more Untitled Goose Game.